Uh, so when we were first hiring, the first major hires we did, um, so the COO is my husband, actually. I kind of poached him because I was like, I see your, I want your skill set. <laughs> so I poached him first. And then um, after that, though, we used an agency, like, a you know, what are they called? Recruiting or headhunter kind of Recruiting, thing. Recruiting, yeah, headhunting agency that we really liked called HireWell. They're based in the uh, Midwest somewhere, but they found us some really amazing candidates. So the first role we wanted was the HR director because we were like, oh my gosh, yeah. <laughs> like, you know, we need help with this. And then we got a, um, she's now our chief of staff, but she came in uh, to assist the COO in doing all of the, the strategy and um, the operations and things like that. So I guess her role originally was operations director and she's moved up to chief of staff. Yeah. Um, but that company, like they really helped us find some good people. And once we found them, our HR director is amazing. So she just helps with staffing constantly. That's key. Yeah. As I'm growing and I'm minuscule compared to your firm, just HR stuff is like a whole thing where it's like, I can't yeah. wait to be big enough to hire. <laughs> so I just yeah. Wait. yeah. <laughs> I mean, yeah, I originally started off with an HR person that I found through Upwork. Have you heard of Upwork? Yeah. yeah. So he, he was good, but it's like, he's totally, everyone's totally remote, but he was in another country and it was like helpful, but not enough. And once I found like that key person that just took a huge weight off my shoulders, yeah. like I don't have to deal with it at all. I only interview if it's like, like, I think the last time I interviewed was for our marketing director position. Yeah. So, you know, it's really Keep nice. Those.